What is going on there guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Hawkeye FC Creator Club Career Man and FIFA 22. We are well, so, so close to the end of the season guys. It's unbelievable. And I, I honestly can't believe how quickly we're getting through these series. Just, I am loving every bit of it. Yes, we have had some really, really tough episodes. We've had some really tough times. We've had the bullshit of, of dealing with difficulty this year. But you know what? Somehow we, we are doing bits. Um, we are top of the Premier League right now. Three points ahead of Liverpool with 11 games to go. Hopefully we can keep that up. Not only that, we have our Europa League round of 16 draw. What well, is against Napoli. So we're still in that. We had to fight that last episode uh, from a 4-3 loss to CSK to go win it at 5-0. Right. The one thing I'm more surprised about is the bloody clean sheet, but whatever. So we have only got four games in this episode. We may have more if we get if we get past Napoli, but most likely I'll just leave it at that that next game if that's the case. Uh, we have got a game against Leicester. Am I gonna risk? Where is N uh, West Ham first before we do anything? West Ham, our ah, oh, they're, they're a bit lower down. They're a bit lower down than Leicester. So I think Leicester is the team we're going to play in the Prem. I do want to play a Premier League game in this episode, so we will play this one. And we'll play with our best starting lineup out there. I don't think I'm going to make any changes. Good thing is seeing that Castro has already gone to an 85, so he's already justified to go in there. He's, probably, he's easily been better than Miranda already. Um, obviously, in the last episode, I did decide to put Jones on the bench for now. Hydara in the midfield, just because Hydara has been brilliant for me recently. But anyway, guys, first game of the episode against Leicester City. Let's go do it. One thing I completely just spaced on is Raul Acuna is on 31 goals. And if you don't know, 32 is the league record. He has gone off this season. He is just another gravy. And if we get him two goals today, or even just one, he'll equal it or beat it. And it, no one else is close to him, guys. He's near enough got a double of everyone else. Can we get a big win here against Leicester? Someone who is fighting to get in them Europa League spots and stuff against us. Can we get the job done here? I'm going to try and get this one inside to Haidara. Put this back over to Jaden Bogle. Get around the side here. The Brutus has come round. Put this in there. Oh, no one can quite get onto the ball. Kuna, can you get that out? Can't quite do that enough. Haidara's going to win the ball back for us, though. Oh, Gavi, brilliant turn! And that is a fabulous goal! Gavi, take a bow! Oh, that is stunning. That is an amazing finish to get over the goalkeeper. About time we scored a long range hit. And that is brilliant. And Hadar has already shown why I put him in there. Look at that, he rides the challenge. Well done, the referee, to be fair, on that occasion. Let that go. And we, with our first attack, has gone ahead against Leicester. Come on, boys. Oh, Castro, you need to just fucking go in there because Silas is a really big lad. And they just passed that round. Holy shit, man. How? Like, that is just... Look at this. It's just one, two, three, four. That is just... There's no touches. What in the world? That is unbelievable football. And I don't understand what I'm meant to do about that. Oh, we, oh, we can see it early. But Castro, you had to be stronger there. Can we maybe get something here? It's a good ball, that. And that's a good ball! Oh, Kuna denied. Not really the best of shots, but Henderson get, had to get to it. Oh, I tried to... Oh, brilliant for Salva, but of course, look at where he lands! Right in front of him! Fuck off! Stop here with this now, FIFA! Stop giving him absolutely everything. I don't know what happened there. I don't know if he was offside or something, but 
Again, how often does it just lay back up for him? The lad, between Neto and Castro, we get that back. He's getting chased here, Neto. Oh, but he's just powering through. And yeah! Neto! Brilliant play by him! Neto just went around the whole team. And we just do the classic cutback. Look at that, just got past Pavard just. I was waiting for Acuna or Vincent just to come free, but didn't. And managed to get it to the Arlo, though. I'll take that. And look at where it goes! Oh, this is fucking hilarious! Oh, this is fucking hilarious! Oh my god, look at where that fucking slide tackle went from Hydara. It went perfectly to the Leicester player. If you're gonna cheat FIFA to make your game fucking play, do it a little bit more fucking cleverly, you know what I mean? Like, look at that, one, two, how many times, how many hits that? Fuck right off. Ah, oh, just after Vincent hit the post. It's like, it punishes you every time a mistake. If you miss a shot, it'll score the other end, no doubt. That is fucking bullshit to me. Oh, I'm not in front of you. look at that. Just look at how Bogle, it's every fucking player. Be fucking lunge to tackle. That's not what I'm after. Oh, just... Oh, I'm so fucking done with this. It's just shit. It really fucking is. You have to just... It's not even... You can't defend against these guys. There's no chance. There's absolutely no chance. Just fucking tackle normally. Turns on the spot, doesn't matter, it goes in. Fuck it out. Again, I'm having to deal with this fight for bullshit, but just gotta keep going. Right, how many times do I have to press the fucking. How many times do I have to press the fucking tackle button before someone tackles? I was fucking spamming it and it did nothing. It just let my bare fucking player walk right in. This game is a fucking cheat. It is a fucking cheat. And look at, look at that. What is Akuna doing? And then he just gives up. And then, of course, we take a shot, goes fucking top bins. Every fucking time, FIFA. You are fucking cheats. This is not realistic at all. It's fucking cheating. It's not even beyond unrealistic. It's fucking cheating realistic. And fuck you, FIFA. That is what, what you're going to stick right up your fucking arse. I don't know how Gavi has just got a hat trick out of that. I'll take that every day. Fucking 4-4. Every one of Leicester's goals are, you know what? The only one I'll say was not bullshit was the fucking, the first one. That's it. Oh shit, okay. Oh my God, we're going again. Come on, Diallo. to work your asses off for this. Come on, and Ahmad Diallo is involved again. These players are unbelievable. I'm not even blaming any of these players anymore because it's not their fault we're in a predicament. But you know what, they keep doing it. I went low, I went hard, and we got it. Oh my God, no one there either. Oh, that is brilliant, come on. Oh, he again has just proved why I'm putting him in the side. Oh my god, he's just gone out adjusting like he's not there. Oh 
my god, and the touch just lets it go to the Leicester man. But, oh my god, what a pass. And oh my god, a mad deal could be in. A mad deal! Shit. 10 goals in a game 10 goals what a game it is FIFA bullshit but you know what you can't say it's not entertaining for you guys holy shit and Mad Dial this is the ultimate team scoreline and Mad Dial he has deserved that goal he's been brilliant and Gavi what a player this is why I keep him in even though he lets me down defensively sometimes he is understatedly an absolute G in that midfield he is a goal scorer as well and we, that will seal it. Even if they got another goal out of bullshit, we have sealed it. We have had to fight from behind once or twice. We've been ahead a couple of times. We finally put the nail in the coffin for Leicester City. And there is the final whistle. Of no goal for Akuna today, unfortunate. But he did play a big part. He was very good. Hit This man got a hat-trick. Unbelievable. I think that might be his first hat-trick I've thrown of him, at least. But unbelievable, it's very rare I get a hat tricks with the midfielders. Unbelievable. Hawk IFC, what a start to the episode. Here we go. We've got the first leg of the round of 16. Looking at the probable lineup they had, I did notice some people they had, but then again, with how deep we are in career mode, it is some of these players are getting on a bit now, but. Still, some very, very good teams still there. But we'll have to see. By the looks of it as well, this is probably going to be all year in Europa League. So it makes me even want to win it even more. And to say this could be like the first like major trophy we win, I mean. I know we're in to win the, the Premier League as well, but if they're the first two trophies we win after winning league titles, what the hell? I we're just, I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining at all. But you know what I mean? It's it's amazing. There we go. We'll have a little look at the team. So almost still in goal. We got it's the same back line, it's the same everything. We're sticking with the same team we put out against Leicester who would beat. Hopefully it's a little I hope it's actually a bit more of a boring game and we just get the win. But oh shit, you can't say it's not been interesting. We will have a little look at this Napoli team. We'll see who we're up against. Gotta say, I think I made a really, really good judgment call on putting Hydara back in and putting Jones to the bench just for now. Just while we're getting some form and and all that, he will make he will come back in and he may even get a bit of game time today. But obviously Gavi's played really well. Idara's doing my job for me. So uh, but as I said, we've got Galini who's a pretty good goalkeeper. We've got um Lodi in there, we've got the Moreno and Neves, Danny Olmo, Rodrigo and Lozano on the wings. Don't know who their striker is. Os Os Turk? Obviously Turkish striker possibly. Not sure. But either way. Can we do the job here like we did against CSK? It took us two legs to really get the better of them. Hopefully it doesn't take us two legs with Napoli. Hopefully we can take control of this leg. We get this out to Gabby. Gabby, you can just swing this one over to Jaden Bogle. Now it's back to Idara. Ah, uh, just Vincent just got knocked off the ball there. Ah, uh, we got. For fuck's sake! It's shit defending! And the one guy I don't recognise in their fucking team has scored against me. What is this bullshit? Look, I'm chasing! But Gavi's standing there. What the fuck am I doing with Simakan? I bring him out of position. 
It's fucking too easy for them. Again, I can't get... You can't get anywhere near them to get a tackle in. When they don't want you near them, they will just pass it around. They have the most perfect movement where it just gets them in the room they need. Oh, for Christ's sake, man. Oh, fuck. Akuna! Just fucking hell, don't let me down as well, lads. Please, don't let me down again. Oh, look at this. Look at how perfect they're trying. They nearly scored again. We're getting so outnumbered. What the fuck is this? Can we get a ball? Fucking hell, almost. You can actually say something, can you? Oh, Neto! Stop! Just stop fucking... You're just merging with them. That is the fucking worst defender I've ever seen! What is this bullshit I'm having to deal with right now? Look at this. Hadara's got... What? Who's going for it? Simakan again. Basaba, get in front of your fucking man. Again, fucking this Turkish bastard is fucking scoring against us. Two fucking chances and we fuck up. You fucking idiots. And now we are fucking behind again. Let her fucking get away. Fuck off, Rodrigo. Of course, they're fucking one of their fastest players is chasing back. Oh my god, Akuna! What are you doing? How are you missing that? Are you fucking kidding me, Akuna? Are you shitting me, Akuna? What are you doing? How have you fucked that up again? Piss off, Oster, you fucking cunt! Oh, uh, Akuna, you're getting fucking bullied. You are getting fucking bullied. Fuck it out. Fucking run, Akuna! Why are you slowing down for them? And you put it right at him, you fucking dick. Fucking get by your locker. Get the ball! Oh, piss off. Fuck off! This game. Oh, it, it, oh my god. I just can't deal with it. i got to say, I am so fucking tempted to put this shit on fucking legendary and just bump up the sliders to, to make it actually a half decent fucking game. Oh my god, what a pass! Yes, Hadara! It's straight back! What a pass by Jones! Come on, we're back on level terms, just like that! I'm, I'm pressing tackle there, and he's doing fuck all. Oh my! Oh my fucking god! I, I just, I just pointed that out there. Oh, go on, Diallo, run! Am I Diallo? Yes! Fucking hell! We have to come back again, but we have again. We've done it again. Two games in a row we've had to do with bullshit. It, bar for one goal, it's all been FIFA bullshit. They've got their goals. Where it's just been stupid fucking goddamn play.
Why are you all in a fucking line? No way is that a penalty. He's in a bar! Get it out! Can we counter here as well? Come on, Castro. Jones! Oh, it's a fingertip save. Oh, can't get that aim. Come on. Come on, boys. We get away with a 3 2 win over Napoli. Holy shit, we had to work our ass off of that. But again, something's not right with this game when it comes to defending. They really. If I could actually tackle right. And it actually wouldn't let me tackle players. Literally, probably about 1 out of 10 of my tackles make it. Or they even do it. It's unbelievable. They really need to fix this shit. Okay, guys. Just, uh, I want to show you this. I'm actually going to make a pre-contract signing. Obviously, we did sell um, the Illich regen in January. So, I'm... Uh, Obviously, I've got Jamie Wright as a backup, but obviously, apart from Vincent, not anyone who's really high rated in a, in a camp position. So I thought, because of the price, I might go in for uh, Medbury here. I'm going to put the out for a bit. So I'm just going to offer him a contract. It's very rare I make pre-contracts, but he's 25. It looks very, very damn good, to be honest. He's a pretty good all-round midfielder as well, so someone who can bring him for next year... Especially if we're in the Champions League, what looks quite certain. He'd be a good little player for us. Um, this game against Napoli, I'm going to actually visually sim it. I'm going to see how we do. If we concede one, I'm going to jump straight in. Um, I don't think... Probably the only change we're going to make is I'm actually going to put Jones in for this game. Um, and maybe play Diogo Dello in it as well. Let's give him a game. But apart from that, so there's not much... Um, overall change but we'll go for that we are three two ahead so if we were about I think usually the limit I, I'd like to get usually a two to three goal lead before I quick sim a game like that especially when we're away as well I can't risk it and after what happened with the Huddersfield game I can't trust it even though even on paper I think our team's much much better um, but we'll see how it goes if we do go one nil down I will jump in because I don't want it to happen what it happened with the Blackburn game when we just in that. But it went 2-0 down and it was just like my team was gone. Oh, for fuck's sake. And they don't... What the fuck? It feels like even in fucking sim games, they're doing FIFA bullshit. Did you see how he just ran through us there? Oh my god, they've done it again. Oh my fucking Christ. They've fucking done it again. They, literally it is. It's like it's affecting the fucking in-game. And fuck's sake, we're 2-0 down. I can't trust the game to do anything right. Fucking run. Get in. We've drawn it up. At least that's what I wanted to do for half time. Fucking hell. I have to do everything my fucking self. That's good from Jones, though. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, you got lucky there. Yes, Gabby! We take the lead! Get in! Oh, we got... I don't know what Diallo was doing there in the first place. He, like, went round the fucking house just to get that ball. What is it? What is this game sometimes? Oh, I'm going to have to bring Diogo Dello off because he's injured. 
Thanks a lot, Napoli, you dirty pricks. Good tackle. Fucking hell, side tackle actually works. I thought Jay and Bogle won out of the way about fucking hell. What the fuck? Fucking hell, thank God he delayed that. Fucking hell, Kuna. Sometimes you're, you're like a fucking donkey. Fucking hell! Fuck this guy! This fucking Oster can fuck off. Yeah, fucking get off. Why is it giving me fucking him? You fucking shitty game! Why are you giving me the smallest fucking player in that box? In Lucas fucking Vincent! You fucking cheating cunt! Keep the ball, keep it. Yes! And we go through! Again, we have to fight back from two goals down. I am getting sick of having to do it. Oh, my God. Just, they are just stupid. They're insane. Attackingly, they are insane. It, it gives me no fucking chance. So, I am going to end the episode here. Uh, we will pick up in the next episode. I hope you have enjoyed. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please hit like the videos and subscribe. Till next time, guys. I am out.